Hello. Here we are. This is my desk. These are my waifus. This one, you might know her as, uh, Pira. And this one is, uh, Hikari. Yes. Um, no. Hi, welcome. This is face cam, except it's table cam this time. Uh, which isn't something that I normally do. Hang on, I have to actually adjust my layout. This is something that I've never done, is like a live unboxing thing. Um, I mean, I've got my tripod here, so it shouldn't be too tedious, I wouldn't think. But, um, yeah, let me just get a good camera angle with decent enough lighting, maybe. Uh, this here is a Fire Emblem Cypher. I have shown some of these cards off before. Uh, also, I'm wearing my uh, my gloves here, uh, so you don't have to see my disgusting hands and also um, preserve the quality on them, I guess. Um, does this have any important information that I have to censor? No? Okay. <laughs> I'm just checking to see if it didn't have, you know, like, my social security number or something on there. That would have been... Cool to murder, so I'm going to use this Kyle Growl Law Pen to, to open the seal on this because we're actually going to be opening the cards. It's not just uh, going to be an unopened thing. Um, now, I f am not super into collecting cards. Uh, I've done a little bit of card collecting in my day, just a little bit. When I was real little, uh, real young, I used to collect the Mario Kart Wii cards, um, which were, um, I never got them all, but I actually really liked them because they had, like, like, hidden carts and, like, here's how you unlock it, because that was back in the days of Mario Kart having a cool unlocking system and not just play game and randomly get character, and, like, no, nah, that was back in the day of... A character that you had unlocked meant you did a very specific thing, which was cool. Um, so as you can see, we've got, uh, Krom. We've got, um, not Radiant Dawn Ike, but other Ike. So, not, not this one, but that one, you know? Um, so, I guess it comes with this, uh, Tiki. And Naomi from Awakening. Uh, what what is this? The the other sleeve that I got didn't have this. Also, I need to set aside. Um, what what are these? Oh, we got Micaiah there. I need to set aside two of these packs because I promised my friends I'd get them, give them some of this. Um, but anyways, so yeah, what 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 is this shit? Um, I actually managed to come up with a setup here that allows me to sit down. I've tried to do unboxing videos in the past, but, um, it doesn't usually- Oh my god, Pyra is falling apart. These are actually not the good smile Pyra and Mithras. These are some, like, I don't know what they are, but cheaper versions of them. I just like them, you know. The good smile ones are, I'm sure, higher quality in, like, every possible way. But, um, all I really want is just statues of Pyra and Mithra, so I'm not complaining. <laughs> Gotta get my waifu statues! Um, what was it? Oh, that, the only reason I said that is because, like, the fucking Aegis is, like, falling apart here. But yeah, like, I actually got this set up in a way... Are these all just the same card? Um, where... I can sit down, because I've done unboxing videos or tried to sit and record some before, but I always did it on my knees, which would hurt. Um, but I actually... This new desk is, like, perfect for this. I, I'm not sure what these cards are. Or, or are these sleeves? Are these sleeves? Oh, these are sleeves! Oh! Okay. That's actually really cool. I already- ha I have some, like, generic <laughs> intro, uh, intro to card collecting red sleeve things. I don't have a binder. I need to get a binder for them all. Um, and then this is, like, I'm not 
I don't really remember what this is, but I'm pretty sure it's essential to playing the game out of this, because there is a game here! It's not just cards for collecting cards like the Mario Kart ones where there is actually a game. The game! And here's the first card that came with that. Um, I really like this thing. It's got Lucina, uh, Corin, Micaiah, Roy, I don't know that one, and Ohm! <laughs> you can see my, my Fire Emblem knowledge will will be tested to its limits here starting with this one who i don't know who it is these cards are in japanese because this is a japanese card game i guess uh fire emblem cypher um and um yeah i don't know how to read japanese so i can't really give you translations on these but when i went to go visit japan and i was in hiroshima i've told this story before but there was a um, there was an arcade that we went to visit uh, near the World War II uh, bomb bombing memorials, um, and uh, it was an arcade like five ten minutes walk from there, and um, near the arcade was a little uh, store that was like multiple layers. And the bottom floor was all, like, D&D, &D, like, dice and, um, uh, also Magic the Gathering. Then the second floor had, like, Yu-Gi-Oh! and Fire Emblem Cypher and some other card game stuff that I was really interested with. And then there was a third floor, which was just a bunch of tables set up for D&D. &D. So... It was, it was actually really cool. Um, it was like one of the highlights of my trip was that. And then obviously me and my roommate are both pretty big into Fire Emblem. So we were totally down for this. Let me, I don't know if I really need to sleeve these, but I'm going to sleeve this one just because it's shiny and nice. Um, maybe. Doing this with, with gloves is rather difficult by the way ill-advised just open these with your hands but i just felt like not um embarrassing myself with pudgy fingers and probably not amazingly trimmed <laughs> fingernails i mean they're cut <laughs> just ugly cut uh well, what what is this i guess this is just Something you would scan if you were to resell this? I'm not sure. Um, okay. Now let's actually get into the meat and potatoes. We have 16 packs, but I took two away because I'm giving those out to friends. So really we have 14 packs here. And we're going to be opening all of them. And I need to kind of adjust my placement here to get a little bit more comfy. Try to stay on mic, though, and not go off mic. So, let's start with the first one. I'm not going to be uh, preserving the packaging on these very well. So, I'm sorry if that is something that you like to see. Okay, so, let's, um, let's start off with what we've got here. I'm not going to, like, shuffle them around. We're just going to deal with what we've got. I don't know most of these characters, starting off with this one, who is another one in which I don't... Here, here's what... I'm try still trying to figure out how we're going to do this. So I have a reflection from the lamp that's behind me, so let me see if moving that will get rid of that reflection. Um... Kinda? Not really? Um, yeah, okay, yeah, no, it did. It, this card is just, it actually just has art that is, like, shining. I was looking at the output and very confused as to what was happening. Okay. Uh, we've got this guy right here. I don't know who you are. Uh, this pulls, this will pull from, I believe, all of Fire Emblem. Uh, there are booster packs that you can get. I should probably keep my chat close as well in case that's necessary 
There are booster packs that you can get that will have, um, like, specific pulls from specific games. Like, we got a Three Houses one, and uh, we got a... I think it was an Awakening one previously. Um, here's uh, Naomi? Right? Is that her name? It's been a while since I played Awakening, but I, I kind of recognize that one. We'll organize this based off of piles of characters I recognize, char or characters I recognize, characters I don't recognize, and then over here will be the cool cards, whether I like, recognize them or not. Um, Samurai Man. Don't know you, but you're cool as hell looking. Hang on, let me... Ah! Get a, another look at this card. Please, fingers. No, bend card, please. Okay. Um, I'm just trying to get this, get a good view of this myself. Uh, I don't know who this is, but it's fucking dope. Dope a meme. I'm sure these cards have like rarity values. If I ever pull one that's rare, I'm gonna not know. This isn't gonna be like a critical stream where we just go through a bunch of these. This this one was the only one that I had because this thing's like 80 bucks, which isn't great. But I like collecting these a little bit. Uh, I kind of recognize you. I don't remember your name, but you're in, I believe, the original Fire Emblem, but also in uh, on Celica's game. Uh, this is Sumia. Uh, oh, it's Fiona! Yes, she's here to do zero damage. Oh, great, great, fuck. Oh, there's her again. Okay. This isn't... Xander, is it? No, this is like... Someone else, but it's a cool card. It's got the... Got the rainbow thing going on with it. I have no idea who this is. Probably a bad guy. He looks very evil. Um, here's this. Uh, I believe if you translate this, it basically... Let me bugger out, figure out what camera angle this is at. Uh, <laughs> I believe if you translate this, it basically reads something along the lines of telling you what you can potentially get out of this pack. Um, I don't really know. I've never translated that. And there's that guy. Who I don't, don't recognize. That's the thing with Fire Emblem. There are a lot of games that didn't come out in the States, and uh, even the ones that did, I didn't play all of them. I'm... You know, if anyone's watching this and not watching my Fire Emblem playthrough, I'm still working through my first playthrough of Radiant on, and I still haven't played that much of Path of Radiance either. Um, there you go. There's those. That's the first real pack all done and over with. Uh, let me make sure I just don't get these cards confused by putting them all over there. Okay so I don't accidentally open them, instead of uh, the wrong thing here. Come on. Come on! Oh, I think I see someone. So, <laughs> Who's that? Who's that? Who's peeking her head? Who's that? No, I don't know you. Wait, wait, no, is this the magician lady? Uh, fuck, I don't remember her name because I don't use her. But, uh, she's from... Uh... The game I'm playing, I think? Magician... La lass. Alright, alright, there's one for the one that we know. This is the other one for the one that I almost won? Um... I I'm terrible with names. I've used her! She's on that first map. And, uh... Part two. Uh, who else? Uh, you? I mean, there's so many blue-haired swordmen dudes. This isn't, uh... Jeffrey, though, right? I don't think so. I'm gonna put that one there. It's not an exact parallel. Uh, we also have Buff Chestman. Who I feel like I recognize, but... Probably not. Um, we'll put you in that pile. Uh, who else? You. Yep. 
Yep. <laughs> this whole stream is just going to be me not knowing 80% of the cards that I'm pulling. But that's fine. I just like showing off the artwork and um, anyone who hasn't seen these cards before gets a chance to see what it's all about. Um, nope, don't know this one. There's a lot of these that I'm pulling that I don't know. I know the next one. This one... Nope. I wonder if... Is there a way... Does these... Do these cards tell me... What games they're from? I, I wouldn't think so, right? Because there's like the green... Does that mean anything? The green... Is the green telling me what game they're from? No. Right? Oh, well, this card was green. The the Fiona card was green. She's from this game. Uh, maybe, maybe? I don't think so, though, because I don't recognize these two lads over here. These two. I don't really know who they are, so... I'm going to assume that is not how this is organized. At all. Uh, right. I can go there. But this chick, once again, blanking on her name. She seemed... She was cool. I don't remember if she was a good unit or not, but I liked her character uh, in uh, Awakening. So, there's one for the poll that we know. Oh, is that... Is that fucking... Oh, yo! This next card. Hang on, hang on. This one... Try to get a better angle of the actual artwork in the cards before I just push them off. I should I should do a manual blur instead of uh, having it be auto. Where is that at? Focus. There we go. Okay. Whoop. I just accidentally closed the properties tab. No, let me... Let me get that. Let me get that. You got that. There we go. Um, I need to get a good camera angle. Uh, and maybe, maybe even move this a little closer, just so I can more comfortably hold the cards. And then... Give it a little bit of this action, maybe 40 zoom, 40 blur rather. All right, there we go. That looks better on the output. All right, cool, cool, cool. But then this last one, uh-oh. I think we, I think I saw a sicky icky. I don't know. Looks a lot like icky. He seems to be doing that one thing that he do. Is this Ike? See, I don't even know. This could easily not be Ike, but I'm pretty sure it is. Um, yeah, it's also a shiny, so this is a cool one. And now that I actually, like, really like and know that I like Radiant Dawn, this card is, like, extra cool. Like, before it would have been like, oh, cool, I know Ike from Smash Brothers. But now it's like, nah. I honestly, I might be jumping the gun here, but I think I might be joining the club by saying Radiant Dawn is my favorite Fire Emblem. It's been a little slow to get through just because, you know, that's the nature of the games. Um, but it was, it's been a very enjoyable stream for me, uh, just experiencing the story. Especially because the game is so fucking hard to get, I don't know if I'll ever in my life own a copy of it. I need to come up with a better way to organize these, because uh, we'll be running out of room if I don't figure something out soon. Anyways, maybe what I can do is I can raise this up again, and then um, just turn the focus off. Just always have it be sharp. Don't worry about background layering and... In shot focusing. I'm sure it'll look a little worse by doing that, but I want to make sure 
I have enough. These card packs are fucking resistant as fuck. Also, I need- I should have brought a trash bag in here for all of these wrappers, but I didn't do that. Okay. Is this mist? Um... Okay, maybe... Maybe the green is saying what it's from, because, uh, here's, uh, that guy. And that guy's from a green. Uh, I don't really know if that's what that means at all, but... So far, other than Ike, but, I mean, even Ike has green on the, uh, on the seven here, so... Maybe, maybe it is. Uh, here's, um... Oh, what's his name? Long Ku? Is that his name? From Awakening? This one we know. That guy, I forget his fucking name, but he was he was good and he's drunk. Uh, this is Sumia. Yeah, this is Sumia. <laughs> kind of hard to recognize her because of the art, but... Oh, I see. If I don't do blur, or if I don't do the focus right, it will uh, be blurry if I put it into the camera's view. Alright, so I guess we'll just do this again. Um, I, I mean, I'd like to do the autofocus, but it's just not that good. Like, it doesn't know what I'm actually focusing on here. But yeah, Sumia. Or, that's not her name. Fuck. Sumia is the fucking Pegasus chick from Awakening. That's the queen of Crimea. I, I know that. And then look, here's Mad King Ashnard killing his dad. Wow, this is really relevant to what we saw today on stream. Wow, okay. And King Ashnard murdering his father. Okay, so maybe the green... Okay, I am inclined to now believe that the green implies where the character comes from. And the blue has consistently been awakening. I mean, yeah, I mean, if you look at it, maybe it's just pulling from these three, I guess. Uh, Path of Radiance. Um... Awakening, and then whatever this guy's game is from. I thought it was pulling from all of Fire Emblem, but I guess not. There's, a uh, Tiki. Adult Tiki from Modern Game. Um... I don't know you. <laughs> I don't know you! Uh, you. You, you make boat. Okay, so these are specifically Path of Radiance. Um, things, so... I might not being- being a Radiant Dawn player, not a Path of Radiance player, I might not get all of the characters from Tellius here, but, um... If I could figure out how to... position myself correctly... Show off this art... Oh, this is Sephrian! Yeah, 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 had to think about it. Sephrian! I put this in the wrong pile. You... Um... Yeah, you are someone. I don't know who you are, but you are someone. And then, uh, Titania. Nice! Got a shiny Titania card. I really like this one, actually. Now that's, that's one of the, uh, my favorite parts of, um, the mobile game Heroes. Is the fact that, um, so many of those, uh, Oh, this music. <laughs> so many of the, um, character artworks are, like, really cool to look at because they're done by different artists. There we go. Let me just actually just make one big pile, I think, instead of... I had them organized based off of each opening that I've done so far, but... <laughs> I think we're just gonna do one large pile. Alright, next pack. Alright, who do we got? Oh, we're starting off with Crom's sister, who I also- I should just have- <laughs> I should just have a thesaurus, not thesaurus, but just a list of, uh, all of the characters from all of the different Fire Emblem games, just so I can remember names. Fucking- I used her in Fire Emblem Warriors. What is her name? It starts with an L. Lissa. There we go. Lissa. That is her name. <laughs> cool. Cool. 
Uh, oh, there's Micaiah. Okay. Okay, so maybe there is some Path of Radiance stuff in here. I mean, we also saw Ashnard killing Dad, which I don't know if that's necessarily a thing. Oh, two Micaiah cards right in a row. Look at this. Both of these at the same time. And they're different artworks, too. This is a really good pack. So far, no repeats. I mean, that's bound to happen eventually, but... uh, I like both of these. I think I like this one a little bit more just because it's brighter, but... I like this because it's dawn. Because of radiant dawn. Huh? 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 No? Well, I tried. What else we got? Okay, so we've got Coverboy. I don't I don't know who he is. We've got the exact artwork of Coverboy. Um Someone is bound to tell me what these what this is. Maybe Jacob will know. Um here's a character from Awakening, apparently. Based off of the blue. I don't know who this is though. Um so maybe I'm wrong, but uh I need to, like, I'm getting too casual with this. I gotta actually make sure that I'm putting this up to the camera here. Again, I'm, I'm just not used to, and then the autofocus just doesn't want to actually autofocus. Hello! We're over here, camera! You wanna focus? Alright, fuck you. Uh, try not to punch the microphone though, Gabe. Can all right. What distance do I have to do this at in order to get this? I gotta figure this out. Where I'm holding it like this, and then it can focus. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Like twenty-five. 47. All right, 47 will do. Okay. Good. Oh, and then this is uh I don't recognize this one despite being from Awakening apparently, so we got to put it in the non-recognized pile. This is what's his nuts that just showed up and uh summon the dragon. Wow. I what what timing to have uh played that segment of the game. Hopefully I don't get any spoilers for what's about to come. I'm probably not going to recognize it if it is, but, you know, hopefully not. Cool. Cool beans. I forgot his name. Kurth? Kurth was his name? Um, oh, this dude. I love this dude. One of my favorite characters from Awakening. Both him and the chick from Ferox are cool. This guy again. There he is. Look at his... Look at that face. That is the face of having a face and then this one I guess maybe sh should I show should I show the bottom of the card too in case anyone wants to read it if they if they know how I've just been really focused on showing the artwork but uh, these are cool and then our shiny card of the deck is um, who? Well, I don't know this one. Maybe one day I will. Maybe one day I'll play whatever game blonde-haired guy is from. Um, from the cover of this, and then I'll play this, and I'll be like, oh! Wait! Hang on. This isn't a character from Awakening, is it? I don't- I don't think so, but they're on a Pegasus, so... Cool sword. I like it. Alright, mostly... Alright, the first pack that I opened was mostly characters I didn't know. This one? Mostly characters that I did know. So that's cool. Alright, next pack! Pack, pack! Pack, 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 pack! We just gotta... Gotta have some... Some waifu in this shot. This is important. Allow, allow me to waifu. Get these out of here. Alright. Just take a moment to appreciate this. I don't like... So the, the, the non-official one doesn't have a stand here. I'm pretty sure Good Smile has like a stand that holds up this leg here. So just in like two years, this statue is just gonna... Boop, 
<laughs> Just give it time. Just give it time. Alright, here we go. Uh, you. Nope. Nope. Don't know who you are. That's not... This isn't, uh, Laura, is it? It could be? Laura didn't have blue hair, though. There's a repeat. First repeat of the day. We'll put we'll put a pile of repeats up here in the middle. Um. All right. So there's that. Here's Crom. Crombert. Crombert is here. Look at Crombert. He looks so young. This Crombert. Is this the duel with Lucina and Ferox? I think it might be. I'm like very shaky hands. I, I'm trying to like. I like, don't know if you can notice. Just like the. The, the subtle movement. I mean, you're trying to look at these cards, and then I'm over here like, oh. But maybe if I hold it with two hands, you'll get a better view of the art itself. There you go. Crombert, another mist. Here's a uh, Path of Radiance, Ike. And there he is. What else we got? Another one of you. I'll put you up here. I think I ran into this character. Or not ran into this character, but ran into this card already. Witch got titties. That's who this is. I've I've dubbed you that. <laughs> Here's this thing. I vaguely recognize this from the intro. I still don't know what this means, but here's something that we're sure to get spoiled on soon from Awakening. I'll put this sideways because I only kind of recognized it. <laughs> I'd set my trap card. Oh, uh, she's from... This one's from... Uh... Awakening. I don't know what exactly, but... From Awakening. Or forget your name. I think I remember using her. Why, see, why am I blanking on everyone from Awakening's names? Garbage. Garbage. That's what I am. Alright. So we'll just keep the uh, repeats pile to be repeats pile. We'll put those here, I suppose. Okay, here we go. Oh, starting off with a repeat. Yes! Excellent! Okay, repeat. Repeat. Uh, horse tending... Burnett. I don't think I know you. Unless this is Astrid. It could be. She has bows. <sighs> when you have different anime designers designing characters for different anime, <laughs> you, uh, it, it's hard to, like, easily recognize every single character that you get. Hello. Who are you? Whomst are you slicing this apple in front of bears and, and animals and the such? Amazing. I don't recognize you, but... Cool card. I like that card. Uh, hello? Okay, this might be something we're about to see soon. But, uh, this is that dragon again. So... Vaguely Rick. Oh, <laughs> who? Oh, oh, I forgot about you. Oh, man. What an amazing character this one was. Fucking top of the line right here. And there we go. Here we have another shiny Astrid. Nice. Yeah. Uh, got the green. It got the green. 
I'm sure there's probably going to be like one or two cards that are in these other packs that I'm saving for my friends that are going to be like really nice. Um. Okay, here we go. Next one. Oh, right, we had... Got to put this card with the rest of them. Ah! Just put that underneath shiny Astrid. And then these ones are repeats, so they can go in the repeat pile. I'm able to sit for this, but the way I have to sit in order to like present this to the camera is a little a little uncomfortable. I'm surprised. I'm surprised this is taking as long as this is. I'm not complaining. I'm loving this, but uh here we go. Same uh uh Yune and Micaiah. Another yellow card. Anything from yellow is something I don't don't know. White is another one that I don't know. Is this box like hint towards who that is? Um, not really. Hmm. So there's that one. There's another. I think this is a new. Hey, is this a new Fiona or is this the same Fiona? Gotta remember to present the card. I think... I think that's a... Uh, I think this is one that we've already presented. There's one that we've already seen, already seen. There go. My favorite... Fire Emblem, before playing Radiant Dawn, was probably, um... Uh, that's... that's a hard question, now that I think about it. Um... I don't really know. It, it's, it's not Awakening, believe it or not. Um... I didn't hate Fates. I I didn't like Birthright, but I didn't. I enjoyed Conquest and um, the third one um, a decent amount. Uh, so, but I actually, Golden Deer Root of Three Houses was pretty damn good. I did like the voice acting as well. The voice acting was phenomenal in that game. Um, here's this dude. I know we're we're like looking for him right now in the game so i don't know where he be but he's he's fighting something he he be fighting and uh this is grail ike's father which i only know that because i've read all the fucking blurb text but yeah this is ike's father being angry over the death of ike's mother i believe i forget the mother's name but yeah, namesake of the mercenaries right there. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we've seen all these cards. Put those there. Oh, hang on, I forgot to put these in the deck with the rest of them. I'm just trying to organize them in this one deck with keeping the shinies on the top in between cards so that way i'm like okay this is where that pack ended i'm gonna go to organize these more later We've got how many of these left one two three four five six seven so almost almost through with it Urgh! Gotta bring out the strump for this. I don't got the strump. There's that one, that one. Cheeky. You know, I feel like it's probably placebo because anime is anime, but I feel like I recognize this character despite not actually knowing what game this is referencing. 
hello. Oh, this is the... The... Fucking... Wait, who is this? I thought this was the dead guy. Or... <laughs> dead guy. I thought this was the king that, like, attacked... Elysium or what? What was it called? Uh, Krom's Kingdom. In the beginning of Awakening, but... Uh, I don't think so. This might be a different character. Entirely. Uh, put that in that pile. These are all repeats. But hey! Here's another, um... Or wait, no. This isn't what I thought it was. I thought this was... Lissa, but it doesn't appear to be... So. Oh wait, no! You can see it right there! It shows the little icon on, on what the game is. So this one has like a flag. And then this one... Has... The uh, fucking... Medallion. It's called the Fire Emblem, but like what? Didn't it have another name? Oh my god. Look at me go. Uh, how many cards? Just these three in this set. I just know- I just noticed that icon that's pointing from what game it's from. Some people are screaming internally that are like watching this on YouTube. Maybe it's from Roy's game? I don't- I don't know. I would think they would use Roy as the poster boy, if, uh, that was the case. Uh, the only reason I say that is just because of this one card that we got before who has all these characters. But then there's also this dude who I don't recognize, so probably, actually, that. Oh yeah, I still don't know what this character is, too. This was from that first pack. Fix, fix this deck over here. Fix that deck! I need that big deck of yours! Alright. Another Lissa. Uh, you... Wait. Are you actually from Ike's game, then? I thought that those characters that were in, uh... Um... Echoes were from... This, but you know, no, it's got the symbol that says it's from from Ta uh, Talius, essentially. Oh, ah, uh, I remember unlocking this dude. Um, oh, I think I forgot to show this card up close, but I remember unlocking the next dude. Um, in Awakening and uh, fucking. He's cool. Despite being like... I, I really liked how Awakening actually just had like... Those like... Villains that were like the villains... That just took you through like the side stories while the main shit was happening in the background. Um... Have I looked at all these? I, I have not. Um... I have now confused my decks. Deck! Confused. Alright, let's put these back over here. Well, eventually I'll learn how to, you know, do a stream like this. Already seen that. Seen that. You. Oh, I don't know who you are. Are you one of the four riders? It's cool. Who do you guys think this, uh, last character will be? The shiny? Alright. Who do you think it is? Can you guess? Based off of this information alone? Oh, I put this in the wrong pile. It's him! That guy! He's from the yellow game, so I don't know. I don't know which one that is. Sorry. Sorry, yellow guy. Cool card, though. Just show this up close. I never got into Pokemon cards. 
Oh, I just shuffled these decks together. Whoops. Um, I think the bigger issue there was I never got into Pokemon. <laughs> but, um... Yeah, I, I... Maybe one day if I do ever get into Pokemon cards, I'll check some out. I had a friend that was really big into Pokemon cards. And so... He tried teaching me how to play the ga the card game once, and then I was just like, I have Raisin Brain. I, I cannot process this, no matter how hard I try. Okay. Oh, here we go. Ah, uh, shit, what's, it? what's this dude? He's from the game I'm playing, I should recognize him, but I don't. Uh-oh. How do I not recognize him? What's wrong with me? That's that guy again. A less shiny version of him. King Ashnard again. That guy again. Seen this one. And another yellow. This might have been that other person that we saw before. Kind of looks a little similar. Could be. I wouldn't know. <laughs> Surprisingly, still a lot... S still... There's still some cards in this bunch that we have, uh... Not... Seen, I'm assuming. Like, there's still some new ones... In at least every pack. That might change here shortly, but for now, the excitement is still here. Oh, come on, we don't want that. Uh, that one again. Oh, here's another Sumia. Is this this? Oh, uh, see now, this one is actually Sumia, but I don't remember. I don't remember you uh, if we had this card or not before. I'll just show it again. If so, no harm, no foul. Um. Okay, so I'm gonna take a guess. I don't know your name, but I heard from Jacob that there is a thief guy that we get later in the game, who um, who like charges you money every time he steals from a chest. So I'm willing to put my bet that this is that character, based off of the gold and the artwork. Be sure to comment if I'm right. Be sure to like and subscribe if I'm wrong. Don't know this one. Hello. This promoted class crumb. Cool artwork. I love I, I love these shiny cards. I don't know why it's such a simple thing to have those shinies. But it's so incredibly effective at making me love the cards. Loving them ever so much. Still no. Come on, deck. The, the gloves are not helping in any shape or form at all. Will I take these gloves off? Nope. Absolutely not. Got sicky icky, Fiona. Here's a new one. Um, interesting artwork. <laughs> Prominent ass! Prominent revolt! This dude again. I feel like I know who this is, but I also don't at the same time. I mean, it's Awakening, so I should know who this is. Um, oh, 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 Raphael? Raphael. Yeah, Raphael. There he is. 
Uh, did I just get... Oh, I thought I got two of the same card in a row. Um, so Raphael, and then uh, What's Her Nuts, that's really bad at speaking. Here, let me show that card better. I don't think I got a good view of the card. And then we got this one. I forget what her fucking name is. I will never be able to remember names. <laughs> and then Ninja. This is Ninja from Twitch. You know him. Uh, is this? This isn't the same. Oh, is this the same person? I wonder. Actually, it might be. Thief class. That would make sense to be kind of ninja-ish. Alright, Ninja himself is a thief. Good to know. I am not here to spread rumors. Just letting you know, you know. Don't get... Don't get confused here. Confuzzled. We've got two packs left. And then there's just the ones that I've left for my friends, which I will not be <laughs> unboxing for them. They can have that enjoyment themselves. Okay. Is that guy again? Ooh, is that... Okay, so this is... Okay, so this is Alm's game, then. No? Wait. No? No, that's not Alm, is it? No, Alm doesn't use magic. <laughs> this dude looks just like Alm. Um, here you go. Let me show this off better. <laughs> Vaguely Alm-shaped. <laughs> Oh, then there's Zelkius. Hmm. Talk real quietly, and you can barely understand my voice lines. Looks good. Looks good. Uh, <laughs> who's this? Is this... A okay, so I guess part of the caveat why I might not recognize all the Awakening characters is, uh... I did not... I did not hit her! I did not! I, uh... Did not get all of the child characters so this might be one of them's or all of the optional characters but there's one character who is like ike's descendant or ike's son right is that this is that this guy because he kind of looks like he's wielding uh ragnell here i don't know remember there was one guy that was like the radiant here oh my god this lucina card Taking off the butterfly mask. She's so fucking... Why is she so happy? <laughs> Get you someone who looks at you like this. Alright? That's important in life. Ah. Uh, all of the new cards have been relegated to the back for some reason. Maybe I'll, um, I'll give some of these cards to my friends as well. These, uh, repeat ones. As well, the repeat ones especially. But even some of the ones that I didn't necessarily have repeats of, I might distribute. I mean, these, I mean, what else am I going to do with them? So yeah, I'll definitely try to organize these and divide them in a way where my other friends can get them. Okay. Okay. Alright, this is the last pack. Let's make it count. Okay, starting off with Taronio, I believe. This is like slightly younger Taronio. He doesn't quite have the, uh, the white armor yet. He's just an armored unit. I like Taronio. Taronio is a good character. A good lad. Here we go. Don't know who you are, but there you are. I'm sure we'll figure that out eventually. Oh, wrong pile. Put that lad again, and all right, last card. Whoa, is that Micaiah? 
Yo, I don't know what's going on in the background here. I'm not sure if this even is Micaiah. I mean, looks like her. is labeled as Radiant Dawn. Or Path of Radiance. Just that, that series, I guess. Um, fucking really cool artwork on this one. I don't... Is that Micaiah? I don't, I don't think so. Could be wrong. I, I don't... I don't know. I guess we'll find out eventually. If I ever go through blue and then there's another girl behind me, I know what I um, witnessed that... The card... That already happened. Alright! Well, that wraps that up. I, I got surprising amount of mileage out of streaming this uh, unboxing stuff. Uh, which was very fun. I, I really like this. Um, I will be doing more of this one day, eventually. Um, I guess just before we go, let's uh, take a look again at all the cards that we didn't get repeats of. Okay, and then uh, I guess we'll set these right here. That'll be fine. All right, and then we'll uh, set the zoom back down. And okay, we'll do we'll do it like this. We'll organize it based off of the three colors: the yellow. Oh, well, actually, there was some white ones too. So we'll do it based off of the four colors, and uh, just see what we got more of, I suppose. Um. Let me try to do this in a way where you can actually see the cards that I'm putting down before I put them down. I feel like this was mostly Path of Radiance, which was good for me, because that's the game that's fresh on my mind. And, um, you know, I, I, I don't mind. These are really, this is a really good cast of characters. Um, you know, I felt like... Awakening story was relatively straightforward. Um, not a whole lot of loops. Uh, Fates was especially really straightforward. I, I like the gameplay of Fire Emblem, so I I'm, don't necessarily exclusively play it for the story. Um, which is weird, because normally with RPGs, I'm only playing it for the story. But I actually really do like the tactical gameplay of Fire Emblem, believe it or not. I enjoy it. Oh, hang on. Another awakening card. But yeah, these are these were cool. Um I guess I could probably just briefly show off so that way it's all in one conclusive video, just the cards that I already have from uh Fire Emblem Cipher. And then I can show my roommate's deck, because he left it out in the living room. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, let me, uh, I could probably go run and grab that just to show off his cards. Um, just for the sake of having it all together in one video. This is just going to be disorganized, I think, until I, uh, can get them all, so... Just rapid fire through all these the white cards. Oh, that's maybe that is Lissa and like as a mage. I don't know. Now that I'm looking at it, because it's blue, so that inclines me to believe someone <laughs> from Awakening. Oh God, I'm vomiting. Okay. Uh, did I put a... Okay, no. It was just shiny. I thought I put a card in the wrong spot. Oh, I love this song. Do -do 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 -do. Mm -hmm. I 
feel like I should probably once again just say again, if you'd like to uh, listen to this exact music compilation that we've been listening to, this is from No Rank, titled Relaxing Music from the Fire Emblem series. It's on YouTube. I mean, pulling from plenty of Fire Emblem titles. Some music, most of it I'm recognizing, but not all of it, which is fun for me as well. I don't think I've sat through this whole video before. You know, actually, when I think about it, I don't really even think of Fire Emblem as having, like, relaxing music. The music that always stands out to me in these games are, like, the ones that are, like, really, like, yeah, we're going to war, pump up the beats. <laughs> Okay, so yeah, I think it's exactly as I said a majority of it appears to be Radiant Dawn and um, Path of Radiance which makes sense considering that's two games worth of characters which is mostly Crossover like I know like Micaiah doesn't exist in Path of Radiance um, But you know still most of the characters are otherwise in both games. So, it looks like... <laughs> we might have, like, one or two cards more. Hang on. We might have, like, one or two more cards from the other, uh... Set here. From the yellow set, then, compared to Awakening. And then there's that one that has, like, four. <laughs> but this was fun. I really enjoyed unboxing all these. Uh, now that we have gone through the whole deck, now will be the time that I... Uh... Oh god, don't, don't look at my feet! Oh god, not wearing socks. I'm... This, this is not that kind of stream, chat. You better calm yourself down. Right now! Do it! Calm down! All right, we're going to put these right underneath Mithra here. And then we'll put... Um, I guess I'll just leave these relatively separated here since they're organized like this. I should probably go through all my other decks and um, organize them based off of series as well. There we go. Well, that's everything that we opened today. Like I said, there are still two packs. So normally these come with 16 packs. So we just opened 14 of them. Uh, okay, yep. Still got two. So we'll put these over here behind Mithra. Uh, and then let me <laughs> let me grab like a a uh, let me grab my roommate's cards and then also a bag to throw all this trash into. So hang on. Be right, right with you. Have to go out this way. I have his cards. I have a Walmart bag, which I'll just throw this trash into now. Lovely sound effects right into the camera, or microphone rather. I'm sure you'll just love all the crinklies right there. Okay. So I've shown off some of these before. I've shown off some of these before, but uh, I'll just show you the entire collection that we happen to have here. Let me put headphones back on. So this set is the set that I have, and then this set is the set that he has. His came with like a map. I think actually they both did. Yeah, you can see. 
We had a Fire Emblem Three Houses set, and then we had this. So this is like a manual that I guess explains how to pl play it normally. Normally when you buy these things, like this is what we, this is what I actually physically bought in Japan. As you can see the yen on the top. Uh, they came in little packs like this, but when you buy big booster sets, they come in boxes like this and like this. These are the big booster sets, and then this is just like, uh, maybe this is equivalent, a little bit more than, than two of these, so maybe like, I'm not sure. A few, but we'll check out, um, we'll check these out last, because these are our cool sets, um, and then these in the red box, which I've shown off before, are all of our throwaway stuff, but... You're supposed to like unfold this and then it is like a playing field like this this is how you apparently play the game <laughs> Just get my waifu to hold this down thank you wife get that waifu I, i'm so sorry that i keep calling them waifus <laughs> yeah and then you put like put some cards put some cards here put some cards here uh, something i I don't know. I think both of us are supposed to have our own playing field. So this is like one player's playing field that we have here. Um, let me get the full scene here so that way I can see everything I have set up. And uh, Actually, I'm going to organize this into a single stack. So sorry, future me. You're going to have to refigure it out. I mean, still organized by series, but... Gonna have to re-divide this later. And you know what? Past me was a bitch too. I hate it for that. All right, we'll put these over here. In that case, and uh, let's check out this set right here. So these are the cards that I've already. I I've shown these off maybe like one or once or twice. Um, this one pulled from everything, as you can see from the artwork here. Uh, even the mobile game, it looks like. Um, I could be wrong, but I feel like this is the character from the mobile game. Um, so. Well, it's this song again. Alright, so here is Micaiah, once again. Oh, I should probably, uh, actually, uh, put this in a spot. Where uh, these are uh, easily visible. These were the cards that at one point in my life I said, Nah, I don't like these cards. I'm probably going to have to rearrange my deck. Um, so that way um, I have more accurate information. Now that I also have you know, played this game. Where is my face cam properties? Where? Where did it go? It won't let me. All right, fine. Uh, focus. Focus. All right. And then let's get the chat back up, just in case if I need that. And then just one last thing. There we go. Excellent. Perfect. Good to go. Alright, so, Micaiah. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to reorganize these. Um, what distance do we need to have this be visible? Is this the right distance? There we go. Perfect. I don't know why this thing can zoom in, like, like focus so hard. Like, what, what are you ever gonna have, like, something that close to the camera for? Um, yeah, here's Micaiah. Uh, maybe I could do a little better focus here. Maybe. There we go. Uh, maybe? Maybe? Alright, this this will be fine enough. Micaiah 
from green. Here's a purple card. I don't know what purple is, but... Purple. Here's another white one. Here's a female Byleth shiny. I'll just kind of organize them based off of series now, I suppose. Oh, here's, uh, here's Sleepy McNuts. I, I remember Sleepy McNuts. Actually, let's do it like this, maybe. Here we go. There's a lot of different series that this is one. these ones are pulling from. Here's a Lucina card. I really love this Lucina art. I'm surprised I don't have this in my main deck. Um, not that I'm, like, <laughs> playing this or anything. Here's Marth. Was oh, Marth is a little white-ish. So maybe these cards... Well, this is like a silver. Are these the same? I think so. Uh, so maybe the white cards were from Marth's game then. I don't know. Uh, here's this guy. From a red series. Um, it's got that symbol. It's like the Fauchion. Uh, oh yeah. Yeah, you can see the symbol here. So these are not from the same game. I don't know what this little red symbol is up here. It's kind of hard to see when I take it that close, but I don't know what that little symbol means. Uh, what game that's referring to, rather. There's another one from Marth's game. So wait, were these... Were these white cards from Marth's game, then? Let's see. Yes. Yes, they were. Okay, so those white cards from before. Mystery solved. Still no answer on the yellow cards, but there you go. Oh, here's her again. Ah! We know you now! We know who you are! Oh, here's a non-shiny version of the Lucina card. Oh, we just Sully. I'm awakening. Purple card. Don't know who you are. Uh, I don't. I want to say conquest, but I don't think so. I don't think that's what that symbol means. Because that, that symbol looks vaguely conquest-ish. Also, conquest's whole color scheme was... Uh, purple. Another one from Marth's game. Oh, no. No, because this is from Birthright. Um, okay. Yeah, that's Corrin. Birthright. Ooh, ooh! Guess who it is? It's fucking Soren. Hell yeah. This has now just become Gabe organizes <laughs> the Fire Emblem cards he already owned. I, I, I love the fucking artwork on a lot of these cards. Even if I don't fucking recognize half the characters, just the artwork alone is fucking like, look at this shit. You got the fucking dragon. Is this Hector? This might be Hector. Maybe. Maybe? Oh, here's, uh, die already! Best character. Oh, everyone loved him. There you go. Oh, oh, look, he's looking less sleepy in this one. Oh, that's nice. Was he even in the map? On the map where the forest was on fire? What? What is this scene? I should separate these a little better, maybe. Ah! Again, gloves not helping. Bad decision. Next time, I'll just make sure before I stream that I'm not self-conscious enough about the way I trimmed my fingernails. <laughs> so I can just not wear gloves. It's a silly reason to wear gloves to begin with, but whatever. There's a green card. Don't know who you are, but you're green. So maybe I should, but I don't. Uh, maybe I should put this in a position where we can actually see all the cards. That would be cool, right? you know, actually see all these things. Maybe I should turn up this light too. So that way we can see them in a little better detail. 
Mate. <laughs> okay, what else we got? Oh, there he is. It's Dan Ven, or Dev Dan, whatever, whichever one you feel like is what he is today. Another one of these. I don't know how many of these are going to be repeats when it comes to um, the, the quote-unquote good deck. Oh, I know this one. All right, this one's Conquest. As you can tell by the symbol. And also just the character. Where do the purple ones go? Gotta remember these purpies. Oh, this one's really cool looking. Uh-oh. Um, one of these characters. Sure do love it when uh, Japan makes characters like these, huh? Oh, yeah. Sure do think those are cool character designs. Yep, yep. Very cool. Oh, man. Don't worry, it's a 500-year-old dragon. <laughs> Which is a real thing in Fire Emblem. Uh, this is, wait, oh, this is not, this is off-brand Camilla. What the hell, who the hell is this? I thought this was Camilla. But, no. This looks just like Camilla. Why is it branded white? Maybe white doesn't necessarily mean Marth's game. Oh, wait, you know what? I did this. This is not... This is Birthright. Wait. What? Now I'm confused. These white cards... I don't know what the white card... Okay, so the white card with the face, I don't know what it means anymore because I just realized... Um, Tamuki is also a white card. I don't know what the face represents. Main character? I don't know, this, this kind of looks like mist on the front, and... I mean... I, I really don't know. I mean, that's... If this is not Camilla, they, they made two very similar characters. Well, here's a, here's a cool character. I like this one. Cordelia? Was that her name? Cornelius. Yeah, see, this is a this is an awakening awakening character, so maybe the face means uh This is a character from the mobile game? I don't I don't I mean all, like aren't all the characters in the mobile game? I don't know. <laughs> Look at this dude! Oh man, this dude's art is like the Mega Man 1 American box art. Oh my god. Oh. I don't know what you are. I don't know what the majority of these characters are. I guess I gotta pay attention, more attention, to the color of these cards. In order to organize them properly. Because, uh... There are some that are mixed in with different colors, even though they're from certain games. Let me just do this again. Fix up all the organization. So far, only one Three Houses card. I guess my roommate got the majority of them. And left me with the table scraps. I'm not complaining. There you are. 
organized it slightly better. Keyword slightly. Another white card. Let them burn! I'm starting to see some repeats coming up with this next card. And the card after that. And the card after that. And the same card after that. Oh, but don't don't get too hasty. Because the card after that, repeat. Card after that. Is this just now repeats? No. No, there's more. There's new cards. <laughs> I just all my repeats in a row right there. Here's a new one. Young Tiki. Marth with his fire emblem. And it's not the fire emblem. You know, it's weird. Fire emblem itself, like as a series, has a fire emblem in every single game, but it's always like something slightly different. Like, I'm pretty sure the true form of Corrin's sword was called the Fire Emblem for some reason. Uh, and then in uh, Three Houses, you could argue that the Crest of Flames translates into Fire Emblem. Um, but yeah, there's that. Uh, yellow Lad. Here's another. These are just standard <laughs> work gloves by the way i don't know if anyone was fucking curious and why would you be but it's a shiny version of that same card we had earlier um here's a cool card edelgard shiny edelgard nonetheless all right i figured one thing out and that is uh the purple deck is um as as called in America, Fire Emblem, just just Fire Emblem, because here's uh, Ellie Wood, not Roy. I mean, I, maybe this is Roy, but I'm pretty sure that that's Ellie Wood. Slightly older looking than Roy. Here's Dark Corin. Actually, no, the sword was called the Yato, right? I don't know what I'm saying, but like. Was it like at the end of Fire Emblem Revelations it transforms and gets turned into the Fire Emblem? Maybe I'm shooting my shit and completely wrong here. This card is fucking really cool to look at. It's from the yellow game. Uh, here's a... Here's a signed card. Okay. This one's signed with, by Alina Yum. Uh I don't I'm not sure if I'm reading reading that name right, but this character is from Awakening according to the symbol. Uh I don't know who this is though. But it's signed. Like it's rainbow signed, so it's not like a real signature I don't think, but that's cool. You'll come to see later that my, um, I have a Lucina card that's signed by I don't even fucking know because it's in Japanese, I think. It's this character again, but now shiny. You can see, see the reflection of the camera. Here, here's Hector. I found Hector, guys. There he is. Finally, Hector is here. This, this oh and this is just like this is like some kind of card that you use the, with the game it came with the uh, starter pack thing there's your boy Demetri male Byleth and uh, Nat would be flipping her shit right now here's Claude So close. Really good Edelgard art. Here's 
here is Sully again. This dude? Okay, so this dude, I don't know who he is, but he looks like Ninja Shulk. <laughs> I don't know who you are. But you're from the red card, which I seem to have the least amount of out of anything else here. Actually, no. We're, we're tied on uh, red cards with uh, Birthright right now. Uh, but that will now change. Here's Corin. Uh, here is Rombert once again. Not my best. I'll end you. Sorry. Fake Camilla again. Here's Ellie. No, that this is definitely Ellie Wood. Uh, that's that's too old looking to be Roy. I already showed that one. Is this the same Dev Dan card from before, or is this a different one? I don't even fucking know. Also, I found a way to do this. Like, consistently have it at, like, the right spot. There's, like, this little rest that the, um... I got, uh, that the tripod has, like, right here. I can just rest my wrist here. And it's, like, perfect... Like, camera proportion. Oh no, look, we can look at it right here. It's not the same card. What's wrong with me? <laughs> Hadn't gotten my green card in a while. I don't got my green card! Uh, don't think we've seen this art before. Another red card. You are from Conquest. Oh, I almost dropped the cards. Surprisingly little, uh, clone cards. I mean, I say as I pulled out a clone and then another clone. Um, surprisingly, um, not a lot of those in this whole set. And then here's the last one from the red box. It's Anna. And this is apparently organized as, uh... Conquest, but you know, Anna's in all of them. Anna should be the white card. Uh, okay, let me get these stacks reorganized. Now, I'll look through my deck, but I don't want to get my roommate's cards mixed in with mine, so I'm gonna have to put these all away after. Uh, well, actually, I should probably just stack them all up now. Since that's that's actually the end of uh, what's what was in the red box, um, movie rental service, and then I suppose we'll look at the last box. Lots of white cards in this set. Not too many um, awakening cards and. <sighs> Lots of Dev Dan cards. That's that's essential. We need Dev Dan cards in order to find peace within. All right, now which set? Which set was what? Was this the repeats? Or was this the original deck? No, these are the repeats. All right, so we'll put we'll put this. Oh, sorry, just punched the fucking thing. We'll put those up there. These are the repeats still. I guess I can put these somewhere else where it's not, like, in the way. Okay. And now, without further ado, we're gonna look at my roommate's cards, because that was just what was on top. So, we kept it in the little plastic seal here. I wish I would be putting back, but if you want to see the full art with that, it looks kind of cool. Without the cards in the way. No, nothing really on the back. A few of these I'm thinking about sleeving already. There's another one of those cards. Alright. Oh, some of these we have already seen, so we'll just kind of rapid fire through them. No need to really organize his cards for him. He can do that on his own if he wants. 
Um, here's a new one. To do. Three houses is still relatively new on my mind. One day I'll stream uh, probably Blue Lion's route of three houses. Um, eventually we'll do that. Hopefully. This deck, I am going to assume, is going to mostly be Three Houses characters. And then mine looks like it could be a mixture of all of it. I know that um, Melvin handed me some Three Houses card from his deck. So, so that way I had some characters that I recognized and not just a bunch of characters that I had no idea who they were. There's another one. Oh, here's here's another Claude. Nat, where you at? There he is. Come on. Ah, organizing cards is difficult. Ooh, look at that Byleth art. It's pretty good. Lysithia. Another Dimitri art, but this one's a little different. I can also just real. I've realized that the focus is good enough that I can just put my hand on the table as well. Finally figured out how to do this. We have a shiny version of this Byleth card. Ah, uh, Leone. Ah. Yes, I totally loved your character arc where you were obsessed with Captain Gerald and then you became obsessed with Captain Gerald. Cool character. Ryoma, hey, here we go. Here's some cards that I recognize. And of course, got to follow that up with Xander. Be gone, Thought. Ah, uh, wait, I know this one. I know this one. Hmm. Mercedes. I had to think of a car. <laughs> think beep beep. Here's, um... Fuck, what's his name? I don't actually remember. Murdered his ass. Creepy, obviously evil guy. Oh, here's Dorothea. I, I really like this Dorothea card. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, it's another one of those. And another one of those. Yes! Yes! We needed more of those cards. Here's Ferdinand. Oh, this this map is slowly just shifting over to the side here. I don't know why. Stop. Please. Bernadetta. Another Leone. Same Byleth art. I believe this is another Ferdinand. Or maybe it's Sylvain. I I get them mixed up often. Pretty sure that's Ferdinand. Ah, uh, shit. I used you. I used you despite being... Golden Deer. Why do I not remember your name? Good unit, though. Kind of fell off at the end of the game. But she was good. Like right at mid-game and like right when the time shift happened. Hubert, that's his name. I, I, I remembered Hubert's name. I remembered he had kind of a very non-threatening name for a clearly imposing lad. Oh, here we go. I, I, I guess I should just hold this deck 
here and just I could do that. I could do that. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, look at this Ike. Oh, I don't have this Ike. Oh, look at that. Is this um This is a white card Ike. But is this like a a class of Ike that I'm going to see so wait, no, that's not Ike. This This dude has an axe. That's not Ike. Who is this? He looks... Is, if this is Ike, I didn't know Ike can use axes. That's interesting. Oh, here's Shiny Marth. I guess we've gotten to all the shiny cards. Shiny Marth, which is the same art from before. This one is Roy. This one's not Elliewood. This is Roy. And then here is a signed Byleth. This one's my roommate's deck. I don't know who that's signed by. Maybe the voice actress? I, I fucking love the signature with the bear, though. It's cute. Well, same Edelgard art, but now shiny. Shiny Dimitri? Oh, yes, Meat Man Raphael! Yeah! Yeah! Yeah. Yeah. And then... Adult form Mercedes. All right, and that's my roommate's deck. I'm gonna put his uh, signed Byleth at the front of the deck. Yeah. So, te well, technically, I bought these, so um, they're mine. Uh, but no, I gave these cards to my roommate when I came back from uh Japan. We had a big day where we just. He came over to my place, because this was before we were roommates. Came over to my place, and uh, we just sat there and opened up our cards, and then we traded amongst ourselves. It was a fun day. Fun day. But yeah, that was his deck. Oh no, Pyra's thing fell. Our back spike. <laughs> I'll fix it later. Oh god, it fell underneath the desk now. <laughs> All right, and this will be the last thing that we check out. I'm surprised I got two hours out of this. I mean, the first hour was me actually opening up the decks, and then it turned into me showing off the rest of the cards that I have. Collectively. All right. But here is... This one, um, so this one came in a, uh, I believe these are called starter sets, um, because, like, they're supposed to have, like, like, obviously they have more than the little booster packs, um, and they're supposed to have, like, everything that you need in order to build a good team, whatever that means in this game. I have no idea how to play the card game. I just like the way they look. But yeah, we're going to start, I guess, we're going to start with the bottom. We're going to do this one differently. We're going to flip the cards over and then see what they are. Because I know I got my good cards at the front of the deck. So we'll start off with Ingrid. That's her name. Just randomly came to me just now. Um, Meat Man, of course. We'll probably have some overlap here. Here's a really cool Lucina card. I really like this one. Okay. Ooh, Celica card. Burning in fire! Nice. <laughs> I've got, got to have a cameo from that guy. Here's, here's this again. I don't know if this is Ike or not. I don't have the shiny version. Oh. That's cool. I'll let my roommate have him. Here's another Claude. Oh, yeah. Young Claude. I'm pretty sure there's older older versions of these characters um, amongst the decks somewhere. I'm not sure how many of them I actually have. 
This plane. Oh god, stop punching the microphones. Bernadetta, we've already seen this card. Sothis. There's the non-shiny version of this Lucina card. Still really good art. Ferdinand. Edelgard. There was a lot of this one Edelgard card. To do. Dimitri. Maybe this is just going to be majority, um... I mean, this was just my, my quote-unquote favorites desk, deck. So these are probably going to be repeats or just characters that I can recognize, at least. Less characters that I don't know, anyways. Marth. Non-shiny version of the card from before. Oh, cool Xander art. They just slide around. Fioni. There's little lice. Little lie. Tell me lies, little sweet little lice if you use. Non shiny Roy. Ryoma. Okay, so I, I, I got these cards too. Okay, it looks like we have a lot of repeats and then all the ones. Oh, here we go. Here's a. Here's Path of Radiance. I, I'm surprised I didn't see this card and uh, the booster set I just opened. Considering this is really similar artwork to the one. I mean, it's not the same one, but uh, really similar to the one that we have here. Just wielding the standard iron sword. Pre-Ragnell days. Uh... uh Do I know you? Wait, are the red cards supposed to be... Uh... Have these red cards been... Alms game? I feel like this is the... The... The, the girl chick from the beginning of uh, Alms hometown. I forget her name. Was it Faye? I don't actually know. More Sumia. Oh, wait, this is a new Roy art. That's cool. Is Ellie Wood again? Oh, you. I remember you. That's a cool card. <laughs> I'll organize this deck later. No worries to do it again on stream. There you are. <laughs> Who is that in the background? I don't know. Is that Sakura? Oh, so! Oh, I didn't... Why, why did I have this card in this deck? I definitely did not know who this was when I built this deck. Unless I just... <laughs> Maybe I just recognized him because I had seen the box art for... Radiant Dawn before? I definitely had no idea who Soth was, though. There's T-Barn. What? T-Barn getting carried by who? Or is he carrying... Oh, T-Barn looks like he's carrying... Raphael? Is this a spoiler? Oh, gotta have more of him! Here's neutral Corrin. Not yet darkened. Oh, Navarre. Alright, maybe this is Fire Emblem 1. Because I think this is Navarre, who I only know because of, um... Warriors. Yeah, maybe. Oh, no. There's Sakura! And, uh, whatever this... Retainer's name is. I forget what her name was. 
is this <laughs> this is basically pyra yeah pyra 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 you have all i got right there Ooh, look at this. Okay, now we're down to my shinies. We're at the end of the deck here. So we've got... This is just... Wow. So this is Marth, Micaiah, the dude from the mobile game, Roy, uh... Corin, and then blue-haired Hector, maybe. <laughs> Everyone is Hector! Oh, here we go. Shiny. Shiny Claude card. Also, I guess spoilers for what? that card was um this is the nice this is the nice boy i like this boy this boy is very good at doing his homework on time i just realized this music has probably been too quiet to like hear that well here's a shiny version of ninja cro uh, ninja shulk And last but not least, you already saw this, but, uh, signed Lucina card. Again, I don't know who it's signed by, but, um, really cool cards. I like, I like these. I don't know <laughs> if I'll ever, uh, buy another one of these booster decks. Um, but I saw it on, uh, discount for, um on Amazon, and then I was like, I saw some other people doing card things for, um, Pokemon cards, and then I was just like, you know, maybe I could buy this booster card thing and get in on this. And, and not, not, you know, not for the views. No, I would never do something like that. But, you know, no, it actually just seemed fun. Um, and I was correct in that uh, predisposition, uh, ass assumption that it would. Um. But yeah. That is, uh, that is finally all of that. Uh, finally wrapped it up. <laughs> Took fucking two hours just to, well, an hour to open up all the cards and then another hour just about to show off all my other cards, so... Long stream, three hours plus, you know, hour, almost two, so yeah, five hours. That's a lot of talking for me in one day, especially since this last segment was basically all just talking. <laughs> um, uh, you might even be able to hear it in my, th in my voice, uh, just the damage <laughs> that has been done, but... Yeah, that's gonna wrap up today's stream. Thanks for watching, if you did. Um, we will be doing more Fire Emblem very soon. Oh, I know this song. Um, like, very, very soon. Like, maybe even tomorrow? If not tomorrow, then, like, Monday or Tuesday. I really want to see how this part ends, so... Yeah, I will catch you all later, and... Yeah, see you later.